Angels. Ms. Finesse here, and we're with the incomparable Timothy Greenfield Sanders, and he has done it again. You might remember that I interviewed him for the Latino list, so he's done the black list, he's done the Latino list, and now he's previewing the out list on HBO. Hi, Timothy, how are you today? Good to see you again, how are you? I'm doing wonderful, thank you, thank you. So can you tell us a little bit more about the out list? The out list really got off the ground uh, after Proposition 8 happened in California. And a lot of us were very angry and upset, and we started to think that there should be a film about marriage equality. And as we started to film, um, we kind of realized that there were more, there were many other important, there were things that were important to people besides that. So the film really evolved into not just about marriage equality, but about financial equality and about bullying and AIDS and all the things that mean something to all of these people. Well, it's wonderful. You have a great assortment of, I'll call them subjects, because it is a documentary. How did you come about uh, selecting people, or how did they come to you? You know, you, you start with a wish list, and you obviously want some famous people, because that's going to bring an audience in. So we wanted Ellen, we wanted Neil Patrick Harris, and Cynthia Nixon, and Wanda Sykes, people like that. But then you kind of try and find people like Lupe Valdez, the sheriff from Dallas, Texas, or Twiggy Pucci Garcon, who's just fantastic, uh, and try and broaden it. You know, Susie Orman is someone we wanted, of course. Okay, so as I had mentioned earlier, you started out with the blacklist. Did you, in the back of your brilliant mind, have an intentional trilogy? And if so, is it a trilogy, or is there another list coming up? We are just finishing the women's list, so that would make it four different different uh, films about identity. But you know, when we started the blacklist, I think it was very clear that there would be a Latino list and something to do with LGBT. Uh, and I think that just certain things got us going, like Ingrid and Catherine, uh, Ingrid Duran and Catherine Pino, who are here tonight. Um, they came to us and said, you've got to do a Latino list. And that really pushed us in that direction. And I, as I said earlier, I think the Prop 8 happening in California pushed us to get off our asses and you know, make this film. Okay, well, Angels, make sure you tune into HBO on Thursday, June 27, at 9.30 PM, so you can watch the amazing out list. If by chance you miss it, if maybe a big piece of furniture has fallen on you and you just can't get to the TV set, log on to HBO.com where you'll be able to find other times and dates where you can watch this, this beautiful documentary. And until next time, angels, keep those Pradas on the ground and keep on living large.